Hello friends, today I am going to tell you how to change the name and the user folder to a different one in Windows 10. The username is what we see here. Now we are going to change the account settings. Here we also see the username. To see the user folder we go to the file explorer. Now to this PC. Local disk. Users. This is the user folder. What we are going to do is change it for a new one that you can choose. Now I'm going to close this window. To start you have to create your new account. Click on family and other users. Now click on add someone else to this PC. You can add a new account with Microsoft Mail just write the email and then the password. That account will have the name your email. If you want to choose a name for your account click here below where it says, I don't have this person s. Click on add user without Microsoft account. Now you have to choose the new name. I am going to write the name of the channel. Now you have to choose a password. Repeat password. You must answer three security questions in case you lose the password you can recover it. Now click next. The new account has been created, now we are going to change it as administrator. We click. Click on change account type. We click here and leave it in administrator. Click OK. I close this window. Now what we have to do is close the session and open with a new account. For that we go to start and close session. Now we open session with a new account. The new desktop is set up automatically we just have to wait for it to end. I increase the speed of the video until the end of the automatic configuration. You have finished the configuration, now we have to answer these privacy questions. Then click next. This is the new account a new desktop has been set up. Here we see the name of this user account. If we go with the file explorer to the users folder we also see the new user folder. Here are the folders of the new user and the old one.
you can see the programs and use them to see that everything is fine. For example I will open the program Audacity. This new account does not have anything in documents, music, images, etc. Once you have reviewed everything, if you wish, you can delete the other account. Let's start, right click. Now click on Task Manager. If we see it like this, we click on more details. Now click on users. Right click on your user. Manage user accounts. Manage another account. We click on the previous account. And now click delete account. If we click here, the files of documents, music, etc. will be deleted. From the other account. If we want to keep these files, we click on keep files. If we click here, a folder will be created on the desktop where all these files from the previous account will be. But for greater security you can save them in a memory unit such as a flash drive, etc. before deleting the account. I click on Keep Files. Click on Delete Account. We just have to wait. Speed up the video a bit. Now we can see on the desktop the folder with the files of the other account. I speed up the video again but you just have to wait for it to finish. The old account has been deleted and only the new account remains. In this folder are the document files, etc. of the other account. And now then only this account has remained with the new name and the new user folder. This is how we change the name and the user folder to another in Windows 10. Bye until the next tutorial.